Yo, hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video. Note takers and planners. This tutorial, we are making sure your digital notebooks are securely stored. Join me for a step-by-step -step guide on connecting good notes to Google Drive in 2024. Let's keep your ideas safe and accessible. So before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have the full information. So guys, in this specific video, we will need a couple of things to be ready. First is our GoodNotes account. So simply head up to GoodNotes and make sure that you have an account in GoodNotes itself. So here you can simply just use to download it on Windows or Android or whatever device you have. And simply that's what you need to do. The next thing that which obviously you will have is a Google account because without it, you don't have the access to any of Google Drives. So make sure you create an account and a free Google Drive account will be delivered to you with 50 gigabytes of storage. After you are done with these two steps, let's go and proceed with the method that I'm going to show you on how to connect these two different apps. So first thing is to open a new tab and search for Zapier. Here we go. And now what you will need to do is to simply head up right here on the Zaps uh, folder or the menu and then click on the apps. After you're done with that, you will have to simply head up to the search and search for both application. So here we need good notes. As you can see here, you just have to search for it. You just type it. Here we go. And if you couldn't find it like that, that means the app is not added. So what you'll have to do is to either uh, upgrade your plan, and I'm going to show you another way how to get your app added without actually letting them know. So upgrade your plan, and basically in the upgrade plan, you should use one of their premium plans, which will allow you to add a specific logic. So here, let me just show you real quick. Um, let me just go back here all right and where is it exactly professional one so professional one it will give you advanced app setting etc etc and it will give you unlimited premium apps premium apps are basically apps that are exclusively available for users who have the premium plan so these apps are actually going to be yours and you can ask them to actually add any specified app now, GoodNotes is actually one of their uh, premium apps. So to get the access to it, you have to get the premium account. But we will get to it very easily without even paying any dollar. The next thing is to simply go ahead and add your Google Drive account. So simply search for Google Drive. And here you will find it. Click on Connect. And then simply choose your account. And after you do so, you simply have to give it these uh, basically permissions. So you have to give it the access to your Google account. Simply give it and allows it to get the access into it. And now next thing is obviously have to do it with both apps. Test the connection if it has been made successfully. So now this text has been successfully done. That means that everything is good to go. Now what we have to do is to create the connection between these two apps because now we didn't connect them together we only added them to our account on Zapier so here how to add them together click on Zaps and here basically what you will have to do to write a prompt so here we go here synchronize my good notes accounts with my Google Drive click on generate and here basically the AI is going to try to give you the best possible things. So here synchronize good notes with Google Drive. Note is created. It will upload the file with your notes on Google Drive. This is exactly what you wanted. If you have any other plan or you had another idea, then you simply have to click on try it again or generate again by right here I mean and it will give you another prompt or another uh, zap so for now i'm satisfied with this app so i'm just gonna click right here to try it after i clicked on it to try it 
we will have these two automations these are both triggers so the first trigger is basically um, basically the, not trigger but the first thing the first prompt is the trigger so the trigger is basically when something happen after that it will be a consequence of that action so it is basically the first action that will happen which is in our case creation of the notes so the creation of the note is basically which will uh, make the notes to be added in our Google Drive account. So here it should be the first action or the trigger. Basically, it is what is called on Zapier. So basically, what you have to do now is to choose your account on both uh, automations and basically fulfill these uh, basic uh, f like uh, formulas or form here. Make sure to only fill the required ones in case you didn't want to. Uh, fill everything and after you're done with filling everything and connecting them together simply click here to publish and it should be good to go and everything will be published successfully so yeah guys that was basically it this is how you can connect your good notes account with your google drive accounts thank you guys a lot for watching and see you guys in the next tutorial